So guys, today is actually the next day because we crawled and crawled and crawled through stores and stores. And yes, we had a really great lunch. We did. We oh. Had lunch. oh my gosh, it was so amazing. But the rest of the day was so amazing too. And I hope that you get a little feel for how much fun we had. But we're not really prepared for... 12 hours of shopping. <laughs> I'm not anyway. My calves are hurting. The bottom of my feet were hurting. Yours too. Because remember last night she said ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-boom. My feet were. Yeah. And um, so anyway, we didn't get to the most important shop because this is a shop that we've never been to. So that's why we're, we're considering this the most important in our trip because we wanted to to experience something brand new. It's a locally owned yarn shop. Um, and so we're headed there now. So hold on and we'll be there in just a moment. You know. And talk about the textures and the quality. Right. And, and what to do with different um, different yarns. Right. And, and what you can do. Like, you know, some yarns, you know, they hill and some yes. yarns, you know, they, they untwist when you're crocheting with them or knitting with them. Whatever you're going to do, you know, like, and then some, you know, like, you know, some have, you know, too many plies that they untwist mm -hmm. or some, you know, it's just a spun over a core and it's a single ply and yeah. why and stuff like that, you yeah. know. So, you know, if you're everyone here and you got questions with, with that, they right. can ask you that too. Ask and, questions about the yarn. Then either. It's really out of town. It is. It's out of town. So it's a little bit of a drive. So we're not going to um, make you wait while we drive. So we're going to blink and then we're going to be there. It's magic. Because, you know, we are magicians. We have, we have, <laughs> you're blinking. <laughs> Ready? Okay, guys, we're here. We're at our destination and we're real excited. Look at this adorable house. How cute is that? So we can't wait to go in and see what kind of yarn we're going to find. <laughs> Lori, what are we finding on the porch? Give me a basket, Viola. Yeah. <laughs> We've got some clearance down here. I am ready. Look at all this yummy stuff. Look oh at my goodness. Sparkles. Every girl needs Look sparkles. Look at this. Oh yeah. Lana Gatto. Oh my and goodness. And it has sparkles in it. Oh yes. Very pretty. Now Lori, you could take that yarn and add it with some other yarn. Absolutely. And then you would have the sparkles in with it. Because okay. it's really thin. You can weave it, spin it, belt it with it. But it's it. just a dollar. Or five, I can't tell. It says five fifty on no, one side. One dollar clearance. Oh, I'm buying all this. You're buying all <laughs> Lori's buying all of all the mine. clearance. All mine, all mine. <laughs> These are four dollars. Oh, oh, and it's so soft. It's hand dyed baby yarn. Oh my god. Four dollars. So Is that soft. $1? It's a dollar. You're kidding. You sure you buy a dollar? It says a dollar. I know, but you sure? <laughs> Guys. Does this not say a dollar? It says five dollars. <laughs> Lori can't believe that it's only a dollar. All those are mine. <laughs> oh my oh gosh. Lord. Really pretty yarn. Oh, look at this. What is this? Oh, it's mine. <gasps> it's squishy. <laughs> 250. Look, Painted desert. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. Lori, it's so soft. I know, I know, I know. Oh my goodness. You're not into wool, right? Um, not really. This has wool in it. Mm hmm I don't want to take anything away from you, but these are mine, too. <laughs> <laughs> mine, all mine. <laughs> well, go get a basket from Viola. Know, Let's enough. look over here. <gasps> Wait, yarn sale, this table, two fifty. What is this? Oh, I have a bunch of this. Poems, you do? Mm-hmm. 100% wool. Oh, my. That's pretty. Oh, look, she makes mask with filters, filtered mask. Nice. Adult two dollars, kids one fifty. Hey, they're nice shapes too. They're not those um. Hmm. Nice. Oh, she has a um a brochure here. Nice. Okay, I think it's time to go in. Okay.
finally get to start watching YouTube. And she's introducing me to all these name brand yarns and stuff. Because I carry only name brand because uh, Red Heart, Caron, Burnett, and some of those others, Walmart and all the big box stores carry, and they get really great discounts because they buy oh, thousands course. and thousands. I only buy a dozen here and a dozen there, so I don't get breaks. So what they sell it for is just about what I buy it for exactly. for shipping. Right. So then I always have to double the price, and then I can, I can do it at Walmart for half that book. And I was always a yarn snob because I had alpacas and angora goats and angora bunnies, so I spun my own. Oh, you know, and if I wanted glitzy, I put a little Angelina in it. Mm -hmm. or something, you know. So I get mine from Plymouth Yarns to this. Uh, Barocco, those are my two favorites. As a yarn, they're the ones that I got these really cute, perky ones from. Okay, guys, so this is the going rate for these really cute scrubbies. Really cute, crocheted scrubbies, and crocheted dishcloths. Crochet pot scrubby, this is made with the, um, the scrubby yarn, really nice. And then these crocheted pot holders, it's a set of two, really pretty, They're doubled over. Nice and thick. Really nice. I like them. Now this is the Eros yarn. And this is made by Plymouth. And it is really interesting. Look at this yarn. Do you see? How beautiful this is. How pretty. This would make a beautiful lacy shawl. Oh, look at that. There's silver and gold and black, blue. Oh, look at this one. This one is very pretty. A very loose bind off, which I use on the shawls. You can stretch out the tender. Oh, you show how to do a loose bind off? Yeah, that was one of my videos. Something, and I was trying to do a loose bind off, and it ruined my cow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was like, oh, I was like, oh, I didn't know yeah. how to do it. And guys, look at this beautiful yarn. This is Kramer yarn. It is 180 yards, 100 grams. 3.5 ounces and it is a size 4 weight yarn so pretty this is made in America and okay. let's see we have 45% cotton 55% acrylic really pretty yarn in several pretty colors gorgeous Gorgeous, gorgeous. So, Lori, what did you think? Oh, I had a blast. I know, I did too. So much fun. There's something special about a local store. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And this was my first time in, well, in a long time. I was probably 20 the last time I went into a locally owned oh, yarn wow. shop. And I was dirt poor, and I was very intimidated. Yeah, sometimes it can be. Yeah. This was very nice. This one was very nice. Very sweet lady. Viola she is she really was. nice. And um, I really enjoyed myself. The yarn is beautiful. Oh, and such a selection. A lot of selection. And, you know, it had something in every price range. And I think, honestly, the highest priced yarn I saw was like $12 a ball. Um, I didn't see anything much higher than that. Did you? I was busy touching. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, the misconception that, um, you know, you go into a locally owned yarn shop and you're going to come out with one $35 skein of yarn or hank of yarn may not be true. And actually, remember, on our way in, there was a clearance rack. Oh, yes. And somebody, I, and rack. I won't name names. Somebody bought the rack. <laughs> Somebody with the initials Lori McCombie. <laughs> so 
some good deals in there. Bought some, yeah, bought some good mm -hmm. deals. And um, so, you know, you never know. So go ahead and find your local shop. Go ahead and talk to the owner because yes. the owner so is, informative. is a person just like you yes. and me. And, you know, I have some clips of Lori getting some pointers on different things from Viola. And it was really nice to watch. Um, so anyway, don't be afraid of going to your local shops. Yes. Enjoy them. They're there for you. Yes.